I mean, I would have been down to kiss anybody on that show. Oh my god, that sounds so bad. <laughs> Welcome back, it's Short Air Beauty YT, and this is the third video I'm filming today. I am on a roll. As per usual, when I film, I usually knock out a couple in a week and then upload them. However, I upload them because I don't really have an uploading schedule because I'm a shitty YouTuber. Anyways, so. Alright, today I'm bringing you guys a story time video, my favorite videos on YouTube to watch, and probably my favorite video to film too, because, I don't know, I'm just sitting here chilling in my hoodie, and I could just, it's like I'm talking to you guys, like I'm telling a story that I've probably already told 10 million times. So we're just going to get into it. As you can see by the title, this video is the time that I kissed Big Boo from Orange is the New Black. Okay, so this all was back in summer of, to be specific, June of 2015, and this was during Pride, and this year during Pride, um, they decided, the LGBT community of Denver decided to, you know, put one on for the lesbians in Denver. Because, you know, it's all about, like, the gays, like, the gay guys. But they don't ever do shit specifically, specifically for the lesbians besides, like, First Friday. So, this year they decided, and they haven't done it since, and that shit was popping, so I don't know why. But they decided to, um, you know, put one on, a, put one on for us. So, they hosted this huge party lesbian party and it was like amazing and this was when i was like talking to my ex like we weren't dating yet we were just talking but we weren't like official or anything and um i so we decided that we were gonna go to this party who and this party was hosted by orange is the new black big boo her real name is uh leah delaria i think i'm saying it right and we're like, okay, it's going to be lit. She's hosting it. Like, the, you know, the season of Orange is New Black. And if you live in Colorado, always comes out Pride Week. Like, it always. So, we, you always, like, binge watch that shit and then go celebrate Pride. So, it's, like, so cool. And so, we were all excited because we had just finished watching it. And she had, like, a lot. I'm pretty sure her role was big that season. Either that season or the year before. Like, she had, um, like, they showed her flashback. And, like, she was really good friends with, um, what's her name? Husky or some shit. I don't know. The crazy one. But the one that doesn't like lesbians. But they became friends and stuff. I think it was that season. I don't know. But either way, we were excited because that was my favorite show. That's our favorite show. So everyone's like fucking favorite show. And so I remember I got so fucked up because I was not 21. I did not condone underage drinking. I mean, really, I don't give a shit what you do. <laughs> That's what everyone says, right? We don't condone it. So, um, Anyways, so I remember one of my friends who is was over 21 gave me their wristband, so I was drinking, and it was hot outside, and I was drinking, and I was so fucking drunk, like, so fucking drunk, and I remember we went to go get food, I was still drunk, I remember laying on this girl's floor, like, just drunk as a fuck, <laughs> trying to get ready, and so my weave was not looking good that night, during the day it was looking good, but these pictures you'll see, <laughs> not looking so good, I used to wear extensions all the time, so had extensions on so we got ready and we went to um and i was wearing like some i don't know this was back in 2015 like you know those skater skirts i was wearing like a skater skirt and a black bralette and like some wedges i mean it was probably cute back then right sorry it feels like there's like um a hair on my face that's why i keep touching my face but um so yeah so i was wearing like a skater skirt whatever we went and they so we were waiting in line for the fucking to get into the uh club it was like at some club or whatever we were waiting in line to get in there and they checked my id and my id is from georgia and i saw my georgia id i need to go get my colorado id i know but they checked my id and then give me a wristband and when you have a wristband that means 21 and up and i like was not even i was not even using a fake i was not even trying to fake anybody and they just let me in honestly i think the guy probably thought it was cute oh my god i swear there's something on my face and it's driving me crazy Whatever, the guy probably thought I was cute or something and let me in. So I was like, it's lit. I got a 21 and up bracelet. I'm getting fucked up. It's fucking lit. So I started drinking and I was fucked up. So then we went to the bottom. Um, 
Anyways, so I'm sorry. I was just started thinking about something because I kind of think they did do another lesbian thing the next year, but I'm not sure. So we went down to um down to I can't think right now. Anyways, so we went down to like the bottom where the stage and stuff was, and we were dancing and stuff. And then, um, you know, vibing, drunk, dancing, have fun. Mind you, I was already drunk when I got there. <laughs> so I was even more drunk, yeah. And then Leah Delaria comes out, out, Big Boo comes out, and she starts hosting and shit. And she's talking shit on the microphone, and everything's all fun. And she's lit. Everyone's lit. She was lit. They had to be. And I'm like, so I tap the person I was talking to, my ex, and I was like, I'm going to kiss her. <laughs> it's like, I'm going to kiss her. And so... I was like, it's happening. I manifested that shit within it's within a matter of seconds. And she's all lit and stuff. And I'm at the front of the stage and I like look up and I was like this and I went like this. And she came to me and like grabbed my face and I like grabbed her face and I kissed her and the shit was crazy and it was lit, right? And she like, I told her to take a picture, but she was fucked up. So she only had a video, but it was a shitty ass video that I no longer have. It might be on Facebook, but I'm not sure. But don't worry, guys. I have receipts. And so after that, I was like, oh, my God. Fuck, you didn't get a video with Elle. You didn't get a picture or whatever I said. And so then um, she did, like, a little meet and greet thing where, like, everyone could take pictures with her and stuff. So we got a drink, and then we got in line. And um, we were waiting in line to take pictures with her and stuff. And it's like, I had to kiss her again. I'm going to kiss her again because um, I need a picture. And so I'm like, you're going to take the picture. We're going to do this. Okay. So we're waiting in line, and then, um, and I was fucked up, but I mean, I probably would have done it when I was sober, like, when I'm single, I'm crazy. So we were, like, in line or whatever, and, um, I was, I was talking to her, and I'm like, you know, you kissed me earlier, but we didn't get a picture, and you know, if it didn't get a picture, and then she, like, finished my sentence, and we said it at, like, the same time, I was like, if I didn't get a picture, if it's not on film, or on, on camera, then she's like, and then we'll say, and then it didn't happen. She's like, then it didn't happen. And so I was like, yeah. And like, then the guy like who's taking the pictures were all tripping. Like, you need to go. Come on. Like, we already took a picture. And I'm, and then she was like, really cool. She's like, no, she's good. She's good. Like, we're gonna take a picture. So then we took a picture of kissing, and I'll insert the photo here. It might be on this side. So yeah. <laughs> so we took a picture of kissing, and then I'll insert another photo. This was when when I told her like then it didn't happen, and she was like, oh, like, oh shit, like we're doing this, and like so there's that picture. So, and I'm, she's short as fuck, and I, when I wear heels, I'm about six foot, so I had to, like, really crouch down to kiss her, as you can see in the picture. But, yeah, so then that happened, and it was a good night, and I had a story to tell, and then I remember later, I was, like, um, like, walking out of line, they're like, oh my god, did you, are you the girl who kissed her? Are you the girl? I was like, yeah, it's no big deal, guys. Um, I just, I thought it was pretty cool, because, like, I love that show. I mean, I would have been down to kiss anybody on that show. Oh my god, that sounds so bad. Uh, um, maybe you guys should like send this video to her, like tag her in it or something so she'll see it. We'll see if she remembers. If she remembers this night in Denver, 2015. But yeah, that's my story time. It was a quick story time, especially compared to all my other videos. But I just wanted to tell that story because it's, I don't know why I didn't think about telling this sooner. My dogs are crazy. But yeah, thank you guys for watching the video. Subscribe, give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching. Leave comments, concerns, questions. <laughs> you guys, I'm not even, uh, whatever. Um, follow my social media so you can keep up with me daily. And until next time. Think of all the roads. Think of all the crossings. Taking